you know, all, all of us can take pride in everyone here at Bayside High School from the custodians to the principal because we all have a part in raising young men like this, you know, and like they say, it takes a community to raise a child and this Bayside community is doing this. They, they're getting a terrific young man, a, a good role model, someone who's going to work. No one's going to outwork him. Uh, he's not going to get into trouble. I like to tell college coaches that my guys will not get too fired on the field or off the field. And that's a good thing. Well, they're getting probably the most versatile football player that they probably have seen in a long time. I, I think and as long as I've been coaching in this, in this uh, area, Percy Harvin is probably the most versatile football player that's ever come out of this area. And I would say that Taekwondo Mazel is the next most versatile player to come out of this area. I, I, you know, I, I keep saying this to everybody that listens, that there can't be a better football player in his class. There may be a guy who's, you know, they'll say, okay, this guy's ranked number one, this guy's ranked number two, and Quinn is four or five or whatever. But the best football player in the class has to be Quinn Bland. And Quinn Bland doesn't play both ways. He plays all ways. Okay? He's always on the field. He would be a D, D1 recruit at wide receiver or a D1 recruit at defensive back who can play corner or safety. And uh, he, he can long snap, he can punt, he can run them, whatever you want to do. And there can't be a better football player in that class than that. Well, right now we, we got a few injuries, but, you know, we, we're going to go from there. You know, we're not going to sit around and cry and lick our wounds and stuff. You know, we're going we're gonna to strap it up on Friday and uh, put a decent product on the field.